Hi, Renee here. Um, today I have another Disney layout for you. Um, this one turned out really cute. Um, I did turn on the camera while I was crafting, so I will pop that in at the end here um, in a time-lapse process. Um, but what I did here was, um, this is a sticker from the sticker sheet that comes with a paper collection. Um, <clears throat> I used the stamp set that comes with that you can get as a part of the um, bundle. And I use this little star right here. You could also cut that star out with the included dies if you like. Um, I kind of liked it just right down on top of the lagoon paper. Then I used um, one of our Melissa Esplin pens. Um, this one is black and I'm not sure, it doesn't really say what size, oh, small brush. So this is the Melissa Esplin small Br brush in black. <clears throat> so I did some doodling and really the best way to do doodling like this, um, I used to be really intimidated by it, but if you keep your hand on the table, don't lift your hand up and expect to go straight. Keep your hand on the table and then just slide your way down. Um, it'll stay fairly straight. Now these are doodles and it's obvious they're doodles, um, so they don't have to be perfectly straight. So um, there is that. Now you will notice in the video, if you watch the the um, construction video, I put this together because I was trying to make um, a complete saying here with happy day, but it just didn't work. I don't like the way it turned out, so I'm just going to throw this in my little bucket over here and maybe I'll use it on something else. Um, but I really like how this one came out. Um, I did make this particular piece straight. This is where my journaling is going to go. and. I personally don't like looking at journaling that's sideways. Um, I don't always, I don't very often put pictures even that aren't straight. Um, but I thought this looked kind of fun and it goes along with the happy. And then um, these two little pieces are part of the um, acrylic shape set that you can also get in the bundle, um, a little camera and a little um, castle. Now I will show you, let me see if I can find one. They have two sides. One side is, let me see if I can get the camera to pick it up. One side is shiny. There it goes. One side is shiny and the other side is matte. Um, I personally like the matte side. So, and the way everything is cut, except for the word, the word magical is only cut in one direction, which is matte, so that works for me. Um, but everything else, you can flip it over. So um, I use the matte side on both of these, and I use my favorite liquid glue to adhere that down. You can really use any strong liquid glue. Um, you can use liquid glass. Um, you can use this glue. You can also use um, multimedia matte by Ranger. That would work as well. Just something that's gonna be strong to hold it to the paper. Um, and then I just put some additional stickers from the sticker sheet and I think this is ready to go. I really like the way it turned out. I might put some shimmer brush on these two just to make it a little bit shiny. Um, but I think other than that, I'm not, I don't think I'll make any other changes to it. Once I put my pictures on it, I might add some additional stars, um, to bring some things out. Um, but other than that, I think this looks really good. I really like the way it turned out. So if you would like a copy of these instructions, um, the instructions I used, I used it almost exactly. I changed a few little things. Um, I put this on instead of, of another uh, embellishment that was in the original. This is different. Um, but other than that, I pretty much did everything the same. But if you'd like a copy of those instructions um, and the cutting guide, just leave me a comment down below. I will be more than happy to get that to you for free. Um, and if you have any other questions, just leave me a comment. I'll be happy to get back to you on those as well. So if you'd like to watch the process video of me putting this together, just stay tuned. I will include that right after this. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Thank you.